Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Sharita, welcome. If you are a returning viewer, thank you so much for supporting on my channel. You guys, today is a self-care day, okay? This is a self-care haul that I've recently done and we are in the season of giving. Yes, this is Vlogmas, but we have to remember to give to ourselves, okay? Because sometimes that's the most important thing. How are we gonna do for others if we're not doing for ourselves? At minimum, just some good hygiene products, some candles, some things to just put you in good mood, good spirit. You know, sometimes the holiday season is not the best time for people. Um, dealing with a lot of emotional things, you know, loss of family, things like that. So I think it's always good just to treat yourself to some simple things that bring up your spirits. So that is what this video is about today. And you know what, without further ado, let's just jump right into it. Okay, so where do I start? We are not gonna spend a lot of time on each of these things. Everything will be linked in the description box below. We've got a lot to cover, so you know what? Let's just go ahead and start. All right, we're gonna start from up here, up top, the face. Listen, I am obsessed with skin care, specifically Korean skin care. And honey, when I tell you it cured dry skin it cured my combination skin areas it just gave me a whole new face okay so for me layering on products with real hydration is key so i stocked up restocked on my favorite toner which is from fresh this has actual rose petals in it this is the rose deep hydration facial toner I love this, okay? This just makes the skin so soft and supple. I think this runs about $45. And again, pick this up at the Sephora VIB sale. So I got it at a good price. Also, with that same sale, I picked up, I gotta open this actually, the Laneige Essential Power um, Skin Toner. This is more like a skin essence. Um, and if you're not familiar with that, it's kind of like deep, like nutrition for your skin, okay? Absolutely love this stuff. This is like a staple. You guys, this is 40, okay? This is 40 and we're gonna keep this face and this skin tight, supple, and hydrated. You hear me, okay? And these are critical. All right, <laughs> okay, so next on the list is going to be something amazing sent to me by the lovely Kaylee. This is, I'm opening it. I've already tried a little bit, but I was trying not to like totally ruin the box for y'all. This is the Vanilla 28 Hand Cream by Kaylee. It smells identical to the fragrance but you guys, this is so hydrating to the hands. So when you talk about a winter staple, okay, this is already being layered with so many things in my fragrance wardrobe. So for this to come out, oh, it smells so, it smells so good, it's so fragrant. So for this to come out, it's just like a no brainer for me to always have this in my purse, okay? You wanna freshen up your fragrance, put on a little of this. This is gonna to add to the staying power. Again, just, just that beautiful vanilla scent that we love so much now in a hand cream. And I just feel it's, it's just so luxurious, okay, on the finger. So their description is deliciously fragranced. This luxurious formula is infused with safflower and sunflower oils, soothing rosemary and ginseng for super soft and nourished skin. And that is exactly what this gives me. I love it. Okay, next on the list are candles. I don't know about you, honey, but I'm a candle girl. Like I can run through one of these in a week if you let me, because I'm the type when I put it on, like. I can start it in the morning and I let it burn all the way into the wee hours of the night until I'm about to go to bed. So, of course, I had to stop by Bath and Body Works to get candles. I love the white barn candles. Oh my goodness. So I picked up Palo Santo. Can you see that? Probably not, these bright lights. <laughs> I picked up Palo Santo. 
and it's just a beautiful jar. And I also picked up the classic vanilla bean. Absolutely love these. Mm, they're so fragrant. They have an amazing scent throw. And I wish I had gotten these on sale. Of course, I would, you know, buy it the day before they go on sale. So they are pretty penny, but I feel like they're really, really worth it. And they're just great quality candles. So that is White Barn or Bath & Body Works candles. All right, the next thing I picked up is a new palette, Honey. And I picked this up at Sephora on sale for $65 because this is usually twice the price. <laughs> this is the Sunset Palette by Natasha Denona. And lately, that is really what all I wear. When y'all see me in these videos and you're commenting on my eye look, honey, it's usually a Natasha Denona palette. Her palettes are just so beautiful. The color selections, but the formula. They are so easy to blend and the colors, they show up for the girl, the chocolate girls. Like, I don't have a problem with no ash. Like, everything is highly pigmented and they just look, look, look at this. This is this palette right here, okay? I love it, They're easy to work with. I don't have a bunch of fallout. I just love her palettes. They are worth the coins. All right, next up is Goshi Exfoliating Shower Towel. Honey, if you exfoliate, you've got to try one of these. This is great because it's a long rag and it gets, you know, your back in those really hard to reach areas when you're exfoliating. And these come in different textures, so they have one, I think, even rougher than this. Like, they go deep, they go rough <laughs> with their, with their um, exfoliating towels and this is just so essential. When you exfoliate, you've got to do that to get those fragrances to last longer because you don't want a bunch of flaky, dry, dead skin just, just messing up the whole flow, okay? You want soft, supple, moisturized skin. It's hard for moisture that you're putting on top to penetrate and really get into that skin and hydrate it if there's a layer of dead skin on top. So. Exfoliation is key. And again, that is Goshi Exfoliating Shower Towel. And these are, yeah, these are like a Japanese um, form of exfoliating towels. All right, and yes, and I picked this up from Amazon. All right, so the next thing I also picked up from Amazon and that is, uh, who makes this? This stuff is so good. This is OGX, but that not stand for something else? I don't know. Anyway, this is it. So this is the Coconut and Coffee Body Wash. Listen, first of all, they have little moisturizing beads in here. This smells so good. I think this is like one of my most fragrant body washes and it is everything. So on those days where I'm feeling like intense cafe or anything with a coffee note or, you know, I just wanna smell, this is everything and it's only like five bucks, okay? The lotion I wasn't too crazy about because it has like a weird um, smell on the dry down, but this body wash, you got to get it. So if you have like, like I said, anything with coffee or rose or this is like a little intense cafe in a bottle, okay? Get this because it is so nourishing. It is smells so good. It's like you can't help but to start your day on a happy note when you've had an experience in the shower, honey. Okay, okay you guys, and speaking of shower, the next items are from Bath and Body Works as well. And y'all, I saw these online and I tried to go into the store and buy them and I was like literally the first customer to buy them in the store because they had to go like digging drawers and they weren't even out yet, okay? So these are, these wonderful little uh, shower steamers. So, okay, so this one is lavender and vanilla. And I think the other I picked up is eucalyptus and tea. And they come in these little pre-wrapped um, packs. So you take the tablet out and you put it in your shower. And when that steam and water hits it, you're literally like in a spa. So it's so invigorating because all that aroma comes up and it mixes with the steam and you just feel like you're in like 
literally like you're having an aromatherapy session with all this lavender and vanilla and eucalyptus just wafting you okay invigorating therapeutic shower is what you're gonna get with these new steamers you guys and while we're in the shower it must be said that if you are using all of these perfume and fragrance body washes and scrubs you know you cannot wash the kitty with that stuff okay that throws off your balance and it's gonna cause issues so I love the Honey Pot line. Their um, sanitary napkins, their, like everything is so amazing from that brand. They have you thinking about your cool cat in a whole different way once you started using these products. This is a feminine wash and it's just, it's amazing. What can I say? If you have never tried anything from the Honey Pot line, just give it a try. They're available at Target now probably a lot of other places. I got my stuff right off of Amazon, but best feminine wash ever. Highly recommend you trying them out. Black owned too, so support, okay? You can tell they were having a buy three, get three because honey, I stocked up, all right? The first one is the one that they say is like a dupe for Baccarat Rouge um, in the stars, okay? Love, love, love this set. Now the scent is actually supposed to be so, okay, so it's star flower, sandalwood musk, sugared tangelo, white agarwood, and radiant amber. So really, it's not meant to be a, a Baccarat Rouge dupe, obviously, but it pairs very well. So if, if this is a Baccarat type of day for you, anything ambery really, this is going to be great for layering. I love these. They're very fragrant and it's just, it's a no brainer. I mean, when you're wearing scents like that, Definitely start out with that in the shower. It's gonna prolong the whole fragrance experience. Now this next one is the Rose uh, Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. And this is a no brainer. If I'm wearing anything with the Rose or if I just like don't even have time to think about what I wanna look, this is what I reach for, okay? I don't have to, most stuff has Rose in it. So this is just the easy grab and go to when I'm trying to layer but I don't wanna put a lot of thought into it, all right? Or if I know it has rolls in it, definitely going to be starting my layering process with this one. And the last one I think is my favorite. I just love the way this stuff smells. Like I'm not into body sprays, but I might have to go back and get the body spray just so I can have like a nice little chilly home, go to bed type of scent. This. Dahlia is smells so good. Oh my goodness. So this fragrance uh, notes feature velvet Dahlia petals, crisp pear, praline musk, and whipped tonka beans. So clearly like it sounds delicious and it is. I love this scent. Okay, so that wraps up all the Bath and Body Works stuff. What I don't know about you, but music can definitely be self-care honey if you're getting things on vinyl there is yes this is Adele honey I had to pick up that 30 album but I wanted it on vinyl Target got me I wasn't even looking to buy a hard copy but I could not resist it I could not resist picking this up it's just something so nostalgic and therapeutic and just classic about listening to a wonderful present day or even olden day like classic record on vinyl. I just love the experience and honey, you pour you some wine, you go down that living room with that fireplace and you put, you, you put this on? Oh, please, okay, like it's everything, okay? I absolutely love Adele's music and just, hello just thoroughly enjoying this whole 30 album okay highly anticipated yes and highly worth the wait you guys and i could not complete a self-care haul without a new fragrance i mean who are we who are we kidding all right finally added this gem bald dear freak to my collection okay this is from byredo and this is just a beautiful, like fruity vetiver scent. It is 
quite unique um and it to me i feel like this is worth the hype it's very hyped but it's it's gorgeous um I think this can definitely be worn year round, but I think this is really going to be, you know, it's gonna shine in the hotter months. But that vetiver is very grounding, so it can absolutely be worn year round. But this is just this beautiful, like citruses and a few florals with, like I said, vetiver. And it's, oh, it's stunning. I love it. I absolutely love it. And so happy to finally have this one in my collection. This was actually a blind buy. I had never put my nose on it. I just, you know, hey, I just took the chance and very happy that I did because this is my sense of the day. Even though it's winter, I don't care. We are doing Baldia Freak and love, love, love this scent. All right, you guys. So that is the haul for today. Drop me a comment below and let me know things that you love to buy for yourself to pamper yourself. Okay, self-care is the best care. And we're gonna keep it going all throughout 2022 as we, you know, approach the new year. We're gonna do more for ourselves, period, all right? Now, if you found any value in the content, don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. And you know what? If you're not subscribed, I need you to hit that subscribe button, honey, all right? And I will catch you beautiful people on the next one.